Do you remember this pop culture moment? And the Grammy goes to Amy Winehouse. After becoming a regular performer at jazz clubs around London and gaining recognition for her raw talent, she caught the attention of Island Records who signed her immediately. On October 20th, 2003, Amy's debut album Frank was released to immense critical acclaim. The album debuted at number 60 on the UK album charts and eventually climbed its way up to number 13. The album also debuted at number 61 on the US Billboard 200 with 22,000 copies sold in its first week. To promote the album, Amy performed at multiple large music festivals and really gained a strong fan base. After the release of Frank, Amy began to draw her focus on girl groups of the 1950s and 60s. This focus shift happened while she was dating a man named Blake and entered a very turbulent era of her life. In 2006, she fell into some serious addictions and struggled with EDs, but I'll be doing another paint lesson on that aspect. Her coming out of these struggles inspired her to start writing Back to Black, 